Hi guys, what is up? So this week's event week we have got kind of a part two to the Halloween week. Um, so part one last week was not, I mean, it had the good, you know, um, Halloween themed missions and anniversary modes and all that. But this week we are going full out Halloween with Halloween week part two. Um, it says reports of UFO held off uh, held off to Fort San Kudo double rewards on alien survivals and more so there you go we have got UFOs in the game now we will get to that in a little bit but we're gonna start off with the two times money in RP on the alien survivals there's double rewards on alien survival plus bonus no plus business battle bonuses it says wrap your creepy humanoid feelers around a futuristic laser weapon and battle down against the armed earthlings for as long as possible alien survivals are paying out double to all players this week so we've had them before just in case you're not aware like normal survivals however you are as an alien with well you can use any weapon I believe but with the alien weapons fighting against um, earthlings in just like you know your normal survival missions except you're an alien uh, two times money in RP on business battles now this is not your normal business battle this is a business battle that occurs only at night why is it at night only it's because it's a freaking UFO spaceship from space in Fort San Kudo. So most, of, well, pretty much any video that was covering the potential UFOs in GTA Online, um, I think like last month or a few weeks ago, um, they found spaceships in the game files in Fort San Kudo with various different little accessories around. This is what it was for. So we have got a spaceship in Fort San Kudo hangars. It says meanwhile there is there are whispers that a downed unidentified flying object has been held off to Fort San Kudo for testing. So we have got business battles in free mode revolving in Fort San Kudo. Like I said, this only occurs at night. So night time, if there's a business battle, chances are it's going to be in the military base. Also, two times money in RP on gruesome adversary modes. So that is all of the normal ones that we had last week. Being, um, uh, we've actually got them here. We've got Halloween Bunker Series, Slasher and Slashers, Lost and Damned, Condemned, Come Out to Play, and Beast vs. Slayer. So all the ones we had last week, we have still got them as two times money. Also, free terrifying tees and more. Play GT Online any time this week to receive a butchery and other hobbies tee, the knife after dark tee, and the orange dot tet mask. If you have not received that from last week you have got a second week to be able to obtain a dot mask that links with the illumination effect for some clothing as well and sticking with the Halloween themed we have got the Albany Frankenstein um, vehicle for the podium lucky wall car now this is probably not going to be a performance vehicle but it is a damn good fun vehicle I mean going by how it looks I have owned one before it is very it's different uh, it's probably not going to be competing with the top 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 uh, vehicles of the sports classic class that it is in but hey ho normal price is like 550,000 so it's not hugely expensive but if you can get it for free it's always a bonus obviously all of this ends November 4th and with the sports classic on the mind all of the sports classic vehicles that have been discounted for the past like 10 weeks have finally gone so you had 10 weeks if you wanted to get a sports classic vehicle if you wanted to get a sports classic vehicle now you're gonna have to pay full price I'm sorry you had 10 weeks 
why it was 10 weeks not too sure but they are gone um, also other discounts include well discounts not include any vehicle discounts from the legendary motorsports site or San Andreas no southern San Andreas autos whatever it's called for some reason there are no discounted vehicles this week however there is 50% off all of the nightmare um, vehicles in the arena war and that is it those are the only vehicles there's nightmare versions of the arena war vehicles the ones being all the pretty colors also 40% off all of the facilities so we have Polito Bay Mount Gordo, Sandy Shores, and Kudo River, Grand Sonora Desert, Fort, um, Lago Zincudo, Route 68, Ron Alternate Wind Farm, and Land Arc Reservoir. R R Reserv whatever that word is. So, yeah. Also, 25% uh, off all of the customation, customizations and add ons. So you got the style, graphics, orbital cannons, security room, lounge, and sleeping quarters, all 25% off this week. Oh no, tell a lie. We do have vehicle discounts, but they are the same as last week, being the Albany Lurcher, the Romero Hearse, and the LCC Sanctus. Oh, they are all 30% off this week. And that, and again, the 50% off the um, nightmare vehicles. So, that is pretty much it for that bit. We have also got, as usual, the premium races. Premium race being a site of things to come. Locked two motorcycles. Time trial is Storm Drain, which is a pain in the ass. And the RC Bandit, no. Wrong way around, Storm Drain. I'll get to that in a sec. The RC time trial, Left Le Le Fuente Blanca, that's a pain in the ass. The Storm Drain time trial. Now, yeah, it's easy. It's a straight line, basically. However, getting to where the checkpoint is to finish it is easy. Actually, getting to the checkpoint is hard. I shall explain. Basically, you have got, basically, from one side of the Storm Drain to the other. That is all you got to do. However, there is a slight jump at the end, which, if you don't land it properly, you ain't winning this thing. You need to land the jump properly, otherwise you ain't doing it. I did this when it was last out on a prior, and I only just did it with a prior because of the stupid jump at the end. So just brace yourself for that. There is a jump at the end. But that is this week's GT Online event week. Not much. I mean, there's not huge amounts going on, but we have got the new business battles with the UFO. I'm not sure if that's going to be happening after this week as well, or if it's going to be a continuous thing, or if they're not going to continue it. Not too sure. But anyway, with that BNB, uh, leave a like if this video was helpful in any way, shape, or form. Leave a comment of what you're going to be doing this week if you're going to be taking advantage of all these beneficials in GT Online, or if you're going to be doing something else, maybe getting ready for Halloween, wherever it is you are, or wherever it is that you celebrate this time of year. And obviously, if you do continue to enjoy, then do not forget to click subscribe and the notification bell to be notified on any future updates or videos I unleash onto the channel. And I will see you all in the next one.